turkey pot pie, okay? Best thing that you could do with leftovers is turn it into a pie. I usually can make a Swiss ham pot pie. Oh, yeah, Swiss ham, so good. It's got cheese, ham, onion, little bits of bacon, like smoky bacon, and then the best freaking white gravy ever. It also has vegetables, but anywho, we're doing turkey. So, I have my gravy, as you see. I did my turkey all separated and stuff, diced, and then I heated it up with some butter, and that, the butter just, it, it holds more moisture in, so it kind of makes it nice and moist. I got my dough ready, and how I did my dough was after I made my dough, I let it rise, and once it rised and double in size, I poofed it, add some olive oil, fold, 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 turned it over, add more olive oil, and now it's doubling for the fourth time. So it'll actually increase its size by four. Got my table ready for my dough, got my pan ready to be greased and lightly floured, got my vegetables, and in here is potatoes, mushrooms, onions, celery, and carrots. You can add more mushrooms, I just add whatever was in my thing, my uh, fridge. And I usually do green peppers, but I'm kind of like wanting tacos in a day, so maybe in two days. So I'm going to save those bell peppers, but for now, this is part one of my turkey pot pie. And I will go into depth and detail on how to make a turkey or a chicken pot pie even, step by step. That includes making the dough, making the gravy, and just doing everything, right? I'll do that in a different video. So stay tuned for part two when I put all this together. Welcome to part two of turkey pot pie. All right, so I rolled out my dough and I placed it on my sheet here. Well, my pan. <laughs> and then laid out my turkey. This is extra that's gonna go strip lines somewhat on top. All right. Time to add the vegetables. Just like go wherever, kinda. All right. Once the vegetables are on, then you relayer it with turkey. And then with your leftover, you could just make a soup. Yay. So that's what we're gonna do. Apparently my toddler is excited for pot pie and soup tomorrow for lunch. <laughs> okay, let's get the gravy on. All right. So you just like pour it on. Beautiful gravy. I'm I love making gravy. I think I like making homemade food a lot Especially when I have company over over dough. Not that hard. Let's make our strips. Okay, so I rolled it out nicely, made it into strips. This is what we're doing. We're going to do cross sections. Hopefully they'll go all the way to a cross section. If not, that's okay. Okay. Pinch the sides. Oh 
my god, this looks super cute. Wow. My family in the living room is watching anime. Mommy's making pie. My dad actually used to show me how to make pie really, really nicely. And he was amazing at it. Me, other, on the other hand, I was not very good when I first started, but I mean, like, everybody as a beginner has their preference and their own styles that they need to figure out and work on. So. You know what? I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll this out. I'm going to make a little heart. It's like a nice little thick ass heart. My little heart. Awesome. When you have leftover dolls like this, you can either fill in certain areas of your dough. Because sometimes filling in is like awesome. And sometimes it's just really well needed, you know. I can't remember what the show is about. But it's, uh, what they're watching is about a lady that comes onto shore and she can turn, like, bottles and everything else into, like, penguins. It's really super cute. Oven time. But first, look at that. Okay, this one is fucking up my vibe, but I will fix that. All right. Good night. Netflix and chill in the oven. Alright. And here is the pot pie. Isn't it beautiful? Ah, can't wait to dig in. Alright. So now I got my pot pie. Look at that. Okay, that side looks messy as hell. But gravy covers everything. So try taste. Do you like it? Yeah. Mm-hmm. The crust is nice and golden. Oh, it's really good. Really good pie. Hey, Dennis. How do you like your pie? It's really good. What do you rate it? I don't know. I'm not rating it. It just tastes like pot pie. <laughs> One out of ten, right? None. None? It's chicken pot pie. Nice. Good, that's all. You watching Yu-Gi-Oh? Yeah. Look how golden that is. Oh my gosh. I'm so happy you like it. 
I would rate this like out of things that I do cook. Uh, the crust is pretty good, but I could have added more gravy if anything. So personally, my rating would be 8.3. There you go. So if you want me to show you how to make a pot pie homemade from scratch, drop it down in the comments or tell me what I should make next. Give me some ideas.